The abdominal area is the most dangerous place to carry extra weight, and many of us know how tough it is to lose belly fat. Coming up to the coming to the rescue is Men's Health senior editor Matt Bean, who is here to talk about the magazine's new book, The Belly Off Diet. How'd you guys come up with this? That's right. Well, we surveyed more than 300 men and women that had actually given us their success stories. We called the best strategies for weight loss mm -hmm. from those 300 men and women dumped them right into the book. We've done so many health segments on this over the years because the, the fat that's around here is the most dangerous fat that's you right. carry, right? It, it's a barometer for the overall health of your body. And not right. only is the fat on the outside, it's on the inside as well. And that fat clogs your organs, sort of makes your body slow down. Nasty. All right, so what are some of the foods we ought to be eating to help change that around? Let's start with this tip. Now, 96% of the people that we surveyed followed this tip, and it's basically to get more protein mm -hmm. in your diet. You want right. your protein to be about 30 to 35%. Now, you can obviously get it from lean sources, like right. chicken, sure. turkey breast, right. eggs, but we've got a couple of surprising sources that's interesting. here. Okay. Um, this is Ezekiel split, I'm sorry, sprouted whole grain bread. And it's got everything from millet to spelt in it. Basically, basically, all you need to know is this. Yeah, I know it sounds unappetizing, but it's delicious. Yeah. And it's got four grams of protein in it mm -hmm. for just 80 calories per slice. And so edamame rocks. Edamame, edamame rocks. We, we eat this all the time. I'm just going to stuff my face with that stuff all if right. we don't move Very on good. here. Okay. So, um, edamame is actually rich in fiber, which is something we'll get to later. Okay. But, uh, real quick, let's just talk about monounsaturated fats. What do you know about monounsaturated fats here? It's the good kind. It's the good kind of fat because right. it actually spikes your metabolism. Now, they're in things like olive oil, but you're not going to sit there drinking a bunch of olive oil. Probably uh, not. Maybe you are. Maybe right. you're on an Italian bender, but uh, <laughs> uh, but you can get it in, in avocados. You Over can get ice it with a twist. With, with, with some balsamic, just as an accent. There you go. Um, but, but these are really good. Yeah. Avocados are really, really good for you, right? You don't want this to be your entire diet. Mm -hmm. I'm not going to say eat this thing like an apple. 15% of your diet. So take an avocado, slice it up in your eggs this morning. Some peanuts. Eat some nuts. And here's a Jedi mind trick. If you get them in the shell, it's going to be harder for you to blast through the entire bag of them. Oh, mm -hmm. smart, smart. And the other thing is, are these off the whatever list? Because these were all poisoned no. a couple of weeks ago. They're better now? They're better now. All right, all right. Here we go. Real quick, what's this? Uh, moving on, fiber. I'm not going to lie, Harry. This is going to get ugly. You yeah. eating your roughage? Are you getting your roughage? <laughs> We, yes. Five I grams of yes. dietary fiber with every meal if you're trying to lose weight. So, mm -hmm. Badia Plus, Angel Hair Pasta right here. It's got everything from flax seed right. to whole grains in it. And doesn't the fiber like help burn the fat or do doesn't something? Doesn't burn the fat. What does it do? It does it something. It kind of hustles the calories. It's like a Hot. bouncer in ah, your intestines. I like that. <laughs> Get out of here! So, and obviously, if you want to get you want to get some sources in the morning, you don't want those sugary breakfast cereals. Kashi yeah. Golina is 10 grams of dietary fiber. If you want yeah. that sugary taste, dump in some fresh fruits. There you go. They are the at the velvet rope of the digestive system. <laughs> That's okay. right. All right. Last but not least, this is my you know a lot of people's least favorite tip, but alcohol actually blocks your body's ability to metabolize fat. So if you want to lean up, it's beach season, maybe cut down on the drinks, especially the carbohydrate-rich mm -hmm. drinks. Go with the wonderful iced tea. Uh -huh. So, right. you know, remember that. It's Friday night. Go out with all your buddies. Yeah. I'll have the iced tea. Let's see what they say. There you go. Good tips. Good tips. <laughs> right, thanks well a lot, Because that's how you roll. All right. right. Matt Bean, thank you so much. For more information on Belly Off Diet, go to our website, earlyshow.cbsnews.com.